So my name is Will Bradley and I'm here presenting today uh, the GMAX Equine Performance Monitoring System uh, that we have developed at Cambridge Design Partnership. The system combines a number of biometric sensors into a single easy to fit package which fits around the girth of the horse. As you can see it's fitted to this horse here. Okay. Combined within uh, this package is a number of biometric sensors and other sensors to monitor the workload of the horse. So we have GPS, we have ECG, and we have accelerometers combined with temperature and environmental sensors. And what that allows the trainers to do is to have a much more objective measure of the horse's workload and also its response to that workload. In the same way that modern scientific training methods and monitoring systems have, made great, uh, have allowed great advances in human athletics in recent years. This system will now allow the same benefits to be reaped in the equine world. So what is the current system? What, what do people use instead of uh, the, that biometric So at the moment a, a, a trainer is typically limited to their own direct observations and, um, and stopwatch timing at best. And even stopwatch timing is often impractical to day-to-day Training. Right. And uh, is there, are you selling that at the moment? Is there, is anyone using it? The system's been used at, uh, at a series of racing institutions uh, around the world, including most recently in the Hong Kong Jockey Club, um, and at the British Racing School, and here in Newmarket. Okay. And but uh, what we're looking for now is we're hoping to raise investments so that we can then start manufacturing the product and making it available to all trainers. So they're just using uh, some early prototypes, are they? Is this just exactly. uh, I mean, research? They're using, they're using systems like the one that we've built here, which we've built okay. a small quantity of for, for trials. So when you're looking for a, to have a commercial product ready? We're hoping that it will be able to reach the market within the next year or so, funding permitting.